This video is going to um, explain to you how the refrigeration interactive exercises work. When you first open up one of your exercises, you're going to see this uh, screen here. Uh, the, a few things it won't have are the instructions down at the bottom and the gray opaque circles that indicate um, your temperature measurement points. Now, the refrigeration gauge is already hooked up for you on the low side pressure port and the high side pressure port. The blue gauge displays the suction line pressure and the red gauge displays the liquid line pressure. Now with this tutorial we have digital gauges so you're going to have to use your pressure temperature chart that you have in your textbook to convert the pressures to saturation temperatures and then from there you're going to have to figure out your superheat, subcooling, what's wrong with the system or if it's operating properly. Uh, the one, the interactive part here is where you left click and drag your temperature probe up to one of the test points and it's going to read um, the line temperature, the physical temperature of the refrigeration line. Now this is how you're going to determine superheat and subcooling once again or uh, do you have a faulty filter dryer? Do you have a TXV that isn't working properly? Temperatures and pressures will change depending on the interactive tutorial and it will help you troubleshoot a refrigeration system like you would do it uh, when you're out in the field. If you have any questions about the interactive tutorial, superheating or subcooling, um, please send an email, use the forum, or uh, give me a call. We'll set up a time where we can we can meet face to face via Skype and make sure that you understand everything that you're doing. So that concludes uh, this screencast. Thank you very much and I'll talk to you next lesson.